from since I was a little kid, I really wanted to see the world from up there. I wanted to see Earth. And you know what? It's, it's so beautiful. Doesn't matter how many pictures I've seen, I can't put it in words. You know, when it hit me is when the eve moved. Only at that moment, my tears will start kind of running. I don't think I've ever had as smooth of a flight as I had on the commercial airline. Not one bit of turbulence. When they say release, I just pressed my legs down, grabbed my straps, the gravity, free fall. But then seconds after that, it was fire, fire, fire. And we went. And next thing I hear the pilot says, unstrap. Clear to unstrap. And I just turned my head to the window and I saw the black and I froze. All I could do is stare at the earth. It doesn't have borders, it doesn't have countries, just one blue fragile planet with no conflict, nothing in this world can compare to what you can see with your own eyes. When I was going to breast cancer treatments, this drove me. I said, I'm gonna beat this because I still have to see the world from up there. Other than fulfilling my childhood dream, I want to send a message for young women. Don't ever let somebody tell you, you cannot achieve something. I was a little girl growing behind the Iron Curtain. An idea of flying to space was as far reached as me growing two horns out of my head. And when the opportunity presented itself with Virgin Galactic, I put my mind to it. I made it happen because this is what I truly dreamt of. So today I became an astronaut.